get some big league chew for this episode. Yeah. spit this out really quick all right we got a lot of news to talk about here i'm not wearing any philly stuff because i have a theory that's going on i'll tell you that later in the video but for now let's just focus on the news around baseball the padres have signed manny machado to a 10-year 300 million dollar contract it's basically what was rumored since november and it's just kind of ridiculous that they had us waiting the entire time and, you know, it was said once that Machado or Harper signs, then it's just going to be like a whole pin pinball of signings. And it's been a day and it really hasn't been a pinball of signings. But who knows? Maybe by the time you're watching this video, Harper's already signed. Is the Padres get Manny Machado. Have fun rotting the rest of your career there, Manny, because the Padres suck really bad. And I didn't really want Manny, you know, basically after his Johnny Hustle comments, I wasn't interested. When he was an Oriole, I actually did like Manny Machado a whole lot because, you know, he's a good player. And then he threw his bat that one game at uh, whoever was on the athletics at the time, played third base. He threw his bat at him. And then he made the Johnny Hustle comments. And then he stepped on the first baseman's leg. And Okay, so the Phillies don't get Manny Machado. The Phillies don't get Manny Machado. Time to turn our attention to Bryce, right? The question being asked around the league right now is what Bryce is right. No pun intended. Just kidding. Pun intended. What does Harper want? Harper obviously wants more than Machado got because it's been reported that he's turned down multiple 10-year, $300 million contracts. So the Phillies should just be like, okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to give you 10 years, $326 million. Why do you say $326 million? It's because it's like a million dollars more than Giancarlo Stanton's contract. But Stanton's making uh, that over 13 years. Harper's making it over 10. So the annual salary salary is more. Har Harper's just like, new. I went the most money ever. And uh, psh, Phillies can pay him. Just freaking do it, please. Now I'd like to cover some rumors and stuff. There's a couple of rumors out there that are saying the Phillies are still the favorites. I sincerely hope so. I'd love to see it. But is it really going to happen? First and thing that I saw happen that really just blew me away was he commented on Reese Hoskins' Instagram page. This is going to sound all stalker-like, but you know all the Philadelphia is doing this, so it's okay. Basically said, like, suh, kid, with, like, a bunch of U's and a lot of I's. The other thing was that a doctor, we didn't know it was a doctor at the time, flew from Las Vegas to Clearwater, full well knowing what was going on. Really, man? Come on, you can't do us like that. Third thing is, it's actually kind of interesting. So you know the armband that Bryce Harper wore in the Home Run Derby? Here's a picture of it. That is being given away at a Phillies game this year. There's another picture. I don't know where to find it, but I do know that is a giveaway this year for fans like 13 and under sometime. Please just sign him. Please just do it already. I just want this to be over. We've waited four months. That's four months too much. I really listened to WIP yesterday because I get it on my phone and I can turn it on even though I live far, far away from where WIP is regularly broadcasted. It was all that they talked about. Harper, 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 Harper. Where's he gonna go? So for the past two days, I've done something really stupid. There was a picture that floated around around uh, Christmas. Christmas, yeah. And it was Bryce Harper wearing a Charlie Conway jersey from the movie Mighty Ducks. If you haven't seen that movie, you better go watch it right now. And basically, I wore it yesterday hoping he would sign. The opposite guy signs. What the heck? And then, um, friggin', what was it? Friggin', friggin', frackin', friggin', frackin', friggin', today. I wear this. This hat. So I'm not wearing Philly stuff today. Bryce Harper used to play for the Scorpions in the Arizona Fall League. I saw him there. I have no memory of it whatsoever. But we saw, I think we saw Mike Trout there too. 
And, you know, that's another thing we got to talk about. Mike Trout. Trout was asked if he would be interested in going to the Phillies, I, I guess, a lot this offseason. Because he obviously had something to say about it. Like, I haven't gone a day this offseason without someone saying, when are you coming to the Phillies? And then he said something that was on WIP a lot the other day, too. Where he was saying, basically, I'm a huge... F-. He goes, f-. PH. And then he catches himself and says Eagles fan. So he could have just been said, saying Philadelphia. He could have been saying Phillies. If he would have said Phillies, that probably wouldn't have been a problem. It would have been interesting to see, though. Now, if we don't sign Harper, then we turn our attention to Trout. But who really wants to wait two years for that? So what if we scoop out Harper and then two years from now, we want Trout? That would be a pretty good-looking outfield. All right, we're done with the uh, free agent stuff. I'm tired of it, and I just wanted to end, so please use your money and use it wisely. Phillies had a little bit of a report today. Odubel Herrera got injured, I guess, rounding third base. Who cares? I mean, we have enough death in the outfield. We got Nick Williams, Aaron Altair, Roman Quinn's a beast. He's so fast that we got backup. I think we'll be okay. Well, the big question on everyone's mind is what the Phil- what the Phillies opening day roster is going to look like. What is it going to look like? And I'm here to tell you that we're not going to know until Bryce Harper's signed. So I'm not even going to address it. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video. If you liked it, make sure to hit the like button. If you really liked it, make sure to hit the subscribe button. We are at 295 subscribers. That's right, I'm back on the subscriber count. I used to do it in some older videos and I want to do it again. Because we're five away, if you can do math, 300. Minus 295 is 5. That's basically what one reporter told us. That 3 minus 2 equals 1. That uh, was more Bryce Harper stuff. And Manny Machado stuff. 5 subscribers away from 300. When we get to 300. I don't know. Maybe I'll do a cool video. Guess we'll have to see. Anyways. Thank you for watching. And. Can we just sign these guys already? I'm tired of this.